Hey guys, Lost Fair, and welcome to another episode of Fortnite Battle Royale here on the channel today. Now, it has been a hot minute since we played the Fortnites, but today, guys, we got an interesting thing set up. First things first, we're showcasing the new skin that's available in Fortnite, known as the, I already forget his name, known as the Overtaker. And we don't have the Whiteout skin, but that's okay. I chose Overtaker just because I thought he looked slightly more cool. And we're also going to be playing the uh, Sniper Shootout Duos mode today. Now, the problem with it being duos is I'll be by myself, so that's already an issue, but it should still be fine. Um, I already played Sniper Shootout when it was solos mode, and I actually won two games of it, so if you're looking at my career stats right now, I've currently won three solo, two duos, and one squad. So, hopefully today I'll be able to get a duos win, I guess, by myself. But if you guys have been enjoying the Fortnite content here on the channel, do click that like button to show your support. And subscribe if you're new, but only after you've watched this video and have enjoyed yourselves. But I guess let's hop right into it and see what is going on. And also, I just want to say, I'm low-key upset the fact that they made, like, they're doing this thing with Sniper Shootout where they're like, Oh, this week will be solo, this week will be duos, most likely next week will be squads. It's like, why don't they just keep it, why don't they just have all three game modes available at once? I don't know. I don't know what their what their reasoning for that is because now I'm stuck doing like I literally planned out this today's video being a solo one because I was like oh I can win it sniper shootout and solo that's easy um and then we're like oh they're gonna give us the duos mode on Thursday oh great can I still have my solo mode back no okay so now I've got to like put in double the effort to uh win this game I'm actually gonna be trying for the win today believe it or not but I guess let's see uh, what, what we gotta do. Now as you guys can see, there's some challenges I still have to complete, but I'm not worried too much about them right now. Um, the question is, where do I wanna drop? Pleasant, I guess, let's go. And yeah, this skin, guys, I think it's one of the more intimidating skins. Uh, and it, it's it's not it's a little bit on the cheaper end for skins. It's not the most expensive, but at the same time, it's like, if you like ninjas, if you like people that are like samurai ninjas that are in like biker gear uh definitely this is a skin for you uh but that's all i can really say but if you guys are new to sniper shootout and don't really know how this game mode functions essentially it's just snipers snipers and stink bombs that's really all there is and that's all you have to worry about so you don't have to worry about anyone like assault rifling you you don't have to worry about anything crazy like that um I mean, with any luck. Oh crap, I forgot, I don't have the controls the same. Oh, this is a problem. This is a huge, hi. Do you mind if I, do you mind if I leave? Can I, can I leave? Yeah, I think I'm gonna leave. Eh. You missed, you missed girl, and now I'm leaving. I'm leaving you behind. Oh no, she got me. Yeah, and the funny thing is, essentially this is all what, all sniper shootout is it's just you grabbing a sniper rifle running for your life and then just move just you just continue i really hope this girl didn't just chase all the way after me just so she'd get this kill but i'm she did didn't she oh my gosh you are that desperate for this aren't you see ya see i really my problem is I really just need a weapon right now. That's the problem. Like, if you don't get a sniper, you're pretty much screwed for the rest of the game. But I have faith. I mean, if we die, we'll just do another... Oh, my. Oh, so now she gets that gun and thinks she's all high and mighty? Oh, well, now she's dead. I'm just gonna... Okay. Okay, I'm a little confused there because it didn't insta kill her. But did I did I mention that's the, that's the new Barrett as well? Yeah, that kind of I, I was kind of like, wait a minute, what the heck? Why didn't that insta kill her when I shot her? But it did a lot of damage. So also, if you're if you're figuring it out, basically with it only being snipers, it's I mean, kind of you just hit the shot and they're most likely gonna die all the time if you hit a headshot. And other than that, it's really just you guys jumping around trying to hit each other. And then if someone really is bold like that girl was, she's going to try to pickaxe you to death. 
which I personally hate when they do that because they shoot you once and they're like, I'm not going to waste my time trying to shoot you again, you know, using actual skill. They're like, I'm just going to spam the pickaxe on you until it kills you. I mean, it's a decent strat if, like, it's the beginning of the game or whatever, but we were already, like, so far in. And she was just like, yeah, I'm just going to do this. Oh, that reminds me. I have to do this really quickly. Eh. Wait. No, it's over here. Settings over here. Um. Um. Wait. Wait. Uh, sprint by default. No, no, no. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Auto pick up weapons on and auto open doors on. Okay, there we go. I was wondering why it seemed weird that I wasn't doing that stuff. Yeah, I have recently set my controls to that because I found it's actually not that bad. I know some people don't like it, like if they're trying to pick up certain guns or whatever off the bat. But for a game of like this where it matters if you can grab the stuff first, it really is like that much better if you can just, I mean, do that. Now, that was a horrible showcasing of this game in the first time around. I mean, we made it to like 30 some people left, but yeah, I know that was bad. I also have to remember this isn't solo. So there is completely the chance that there will be a, uh, there will be, like, a team fighting me. But then again, like, if I had to guess, it might not actually be that way. Oh, there's someone here also. Either way, don't open that door, don't open that door, don't walk in here. Awesome. Hello? have the spam sniper rifle so i have a slight advantage here no boogie bomb really people are cruel okay that's one down uh oh i'm out of ammo uh oh i'm out of ammo retreat now she's just gonna be chasing me for the rest of the game. I love it. Oh, I know she got a shot off. No. No. Yeah, see, she's just coming at me trying to pickaxe me now. And it's hilarious, because it's not happening. <laughs> hey, other people. Other people. I need help. Help. I am in need of help. He's actually still trying to pickaxe me. This is hilarious. I can keep this up forever, girl. Don't worry. Can you say holding a grudge? And the funny thing is, I'm at 10 health, so if anything touches me, I will actually die. Here, give me a second. Gotta get that little, little extra boost going. There we go. Ammo? I'll take it. Hello? Oh, pff, that scared the crap out of me. I was like, hello? Like, it looked like there was someone right next to me for a minute there, but was, oh, look, there's that girl again. So she actually did follow me all the way through that house. Wow. That's funny. Okay, guys. Okay, enough messing around. Let's actually, let's actually, uh, do well in a game. Now, again, remember, I'm always at a disadvantage because it's 2v1. But it was funny because... That girl, instead of me killing her team and she being like, okay, he poses a threat, let me either retreat or let me go after other people now. No, she just followed me around the whole map until she got the kill. Didn't care that I ran in between like five different people. She was like, no, I'm going to make sure I get this kill. And like, I, I'm just saying personally, I would never do that. I would never per like hunt down. Like if I was playing with my teammate and they die. I wouldn't just hunt down the other person for the rest of the game and not care if I die or not. Like, what's the? how are you then playing the game? You're just basically stating, oh, I give up already. I don't care what happens to me. I just want to kill this one person and I'm good. Oh, hey there. I christen you with the llamas. Have a beach ball. Yeah, I, I redid my, uh, my, my hot dances. There are hot keys there, so I uh, have a little bit more options now other than just dances. I noticed that's kind of like, I, I, want, I want to throw beach balls at people. That's basically what I wanted to do. All right, Pleasant Park, give me another chance. Let's see. Also, I've noticed in this game when people are very, like, triggered. I've no, I've, like, I know there's no voice chattering things. You can't actually hear how people's emotions are when you kill them or, like, when, you, when you're, like, getting on their nerves. 
but you can sometimes just feel it. But like, you can sometimes just in the middle of a game, like, wow, that person actually is acting like they're they're upset about something right now. It's kind of funny. Like, I killed the girl's teammate. Like, she got me down to 10 health, so she just tried pickaxing me for the rest of the game. When she had two guns, one a spam sniper rifle and the other one was a hunting rifle, she could have used either of those against me. She instead decided, no, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna spam my pickaxe at him because I'm angry. Like, really? <laughs> also, looking like there's a lot of people here. Uh, a lot of people doing things. I'm just gonna... There's nothing in here. However, hunting rifle ammo is good to grab right off the bat. I will say that. Um, that person just... I don't know what he's doing over there. He's kind of just standing there. Here, I'm going to grab the this. Because although I don't have a hunting rifle, there's a chest in the middle of the map. I need it! I'm just going to throw a stink bomb over there to distract those people. Um, and another thing, guys, is... I've noticed that uh the barret so like if i could get the barret i could showcase that i'm kind of doing like three update videos at once i'm showcasing the barret i'm showcasing the new skin and i'm showcasing this girl about to get shot in the head oh i missed dang i also did i mentioned i don't like having just this gun do these people not have anything they just need <laughs> Okay, I need to get a better gun than this. I don't like using just the scope to salt rifle. Right, hello, people. And really, it's just you taking pot shots at everyone and hoping uh, somebody kind of just holds still for a second. Like, look at this. Okay, there we go. That'll throw them off. Oh, I got one. Nice. Hey, don't shoot at me. I want that I want that stuff. Can I have that stuff, sir? Oh wait, he's down there. I need the hunting rifle. I need that. Thank you. Reorganize. I also, I don't know why it's the thing to build in this game mode. Uh-oh, I'm out of building. Wait, did she just oh. No! I just got stopped by two different people. Were they on the same team? No, they were on the same team. Okay, because that, that threw me off. Like, she stopped and looked to the left, and I was like, oh, she, she got distracted by someone else. No, she, that was her teammate. So that's what I'm talking about. Why couldn't they have had this thing in solo mode today? I'm so upset about that. Like, I mean, I don't care this is slightly challenge, more challenging than just solo. I mean, I don't know what's challenging about just jumping around like a rabbit and firing and hoping that RNG just works and you kill the person each time, but, like, like, if you think about it, Sniper Shootout is 25% actually, like, hiding and sniping people. It's more or less 75% just running up to someone and shooting them. Now, I'm just saying, if you have the Barret, there's no point in building. Because the Barret can instantly destroy any material in one shot. So if someone starts building a staircase, speaking of, there's the Barret right there. Let me see if I can get to it before the game starts. So I can show you guys what I mean. So, if I grab this Barret and shoot this wall, pretend like someone just built behind that and I switch to another sniper and shoot again. Like, they can't... Oh, wow, I didn't destroy that. But look how much damage that did to this. That's a thousand material knocked down to a hundred. So that did about 900 damage to that, that uh, crate. Like, that's pretty insane. Also, staying to the point that, like... Uh, there's really no hiding <laughs> when you have a gun like that and I haven't seen it much in regular multiplayer on here like I haven't seen it in like the regular solos or duos or anything that much maybe like once a game I've seen someone with it so it's not that common it's just in sniper shootout they wanted to make it like testing out the new gun seeing how people like it and I personally do enjoy it a lot um I don't like how it takes forever to reload, but I guess that's the only way they could have really balanced it for the game. Is there a chest right there? There better be. I didn't just... I hope I didn't just run over here for no reason. I think I just ran over here for no reason. Great. Also, what sucks is if a team of two feels like pickaxing me, I can't fight that. Because even if I get perfect hits off on one of them, the other one's just going to be at full health. And I'm going to die to just a team pickaxing me. 
so we'll see how that goes, but I'm going to make my way to this abandoned house over here that looks like it has stuff for me. Also, shield is very important. Uh, with the Barret, unless you're at full 200 health, so full shield and full um, health, the Barret can one-shot you. And that's pretty bad. I don't know what the differences in, are between like the headshot and the body shot with the Barret, but all I know is from my experience... If you aren't, uh, if you aren't rocking the full hundo hundo club, you're in trouble. But, okay, starting off with the hunting rifle. Um, the dual hunting rifles, like having two, two hunting rifles and swapping between them is very meta in this game mode. So, like, my final setup is normally two blue hunting rifles and two barrets. It doesn't really matter which color the barret is, they both are destructive as all heck. Like... They'll get the job done. The Barretts are more or less for the distraction and the way of, like, destroying structures. So they take so long to reload, you're only going to get one to two shots with them. And then the Hunting Rifles is, like, for the rest of the match, you're just kind of uh, shooting each person, etc. Oh, there's someone in here. Oh, that's a trap. That's a trap. Not dealing with that. Sorry. Alright, so... Aside from me not dying to a trap today... Oh, there's a person there. There's a person there. Look at them go. They're so elegant. Dang it, I missed. <laughs> also, the funny thing is, like, in this game mode, you can never tell if someone's a no-skin or not. Because, like, normally you can tell by, like, building and how someone's shooting or whatever. But in this game mode... Oh, by the way, vending machines got nerfed heavily. By nerfed, I mean buffed. Like, it doesn't cost as much to use their, uh their resource to like for resources anymore as you saw it was only 300 for that purple vending machine before it was 400 so that's i guess good if you rely a lot on vending machines um but yeah the the whole like this whole sniper shootout mode is literally just luck based and then at the end if someone makes a mistake that's really all it is because at the end, like, it doesn't matter how much you build, because you're going to eventually have to peek your head out to shoot someone with a sniper, and then, depending on how good of a shot you are, the other person can just do the same thing and just... Oh, that was the Barret. Yeah, if you hear a giant cannon sound, that's normally the Barret. Oh, another hunting rifle, I'll take it. Now we got two of them. And, okay, no shield, perfect. I love when I don't show, but I do have the launch pad. Also, if you want to get good at just building quickly and having quick reflexes with, like, again, building, uh, using jump pads, launch pads, whatever, this is the game mode for you. Um, just to be able to quickly swap between from one thing to another, it's very uh, relevant, I think. At least for this game mode, I'd say. I would have never thought that much. Did I just... I really thought I just jumped down on someone. Hello? Oh, I see a person right there. Oh. oh, hi. So for for a little bit of reference point, if uh, the Barret hits me once, I'm practically dead. Yeah, he's trying to hit me with that. He wants that to be the thing to kill me. And the other reason why I like Sniper Shootout is literally it's just all about, um... Oh, that looked like it went right into me. Okay, I'll take it. I'll take that. 110%. Give me your stuff. Thank you so much. Come back later for another try. Please, I need that. Okay, so I don't actually need that right now, but I'm keeping it. Uh, what else do you have? The spam one. I'll take it. Yeah, see, he was prioritizing just reloading with this. He probably should use the spam one. Because it takes so much time to reload this dang gun that, there, like, is it really worth it? Oh, for those of you who haven't played in a while, Slurp Juice now does 75 shield if you're not injured. And then if you are injured, it heals up basically up to 75 of your health before it does shield. It doesn't do both at once anymore. So, take that as you will. Um, I kind of like it. It gives it a lot more, like, strategic value now into when you want to drink it and not just, oh, I just want the regenerating uh, 50. 
Like, it's 75 now, and then whatever you want to drink, it depends on what it heals. But I feel like there's one more person here in Pleasant. Or, this is Salty, not Pleasant. Oh, yep, that would be a person right there. So if I want this tree gone, or if I want that person to... That shot. If that would have hit right there... Okay, so he's... Okay, tree, get out of here. I missed the tree. I hit something, but I missed the tree. Yeah. Yeah. Kind of expected that to happen. Did I get his... Does he have a teammate or was he by himself? And also the other thing, with the whole... Um, there only being like, what, three types of snipers in this game? Once you get fully upgraded with the snipers, you don't really need any more snipers. So like, I'm at two hunting rifles now that are blue. I don't need another hunting rifle. Um, and there's no better type of gun. So now... It's like, I'm the only reason I would... Oh, he had launch pads. I did not know that. Um, so why wasn't he really using them? I still wish I would have hit that shot when he was in midair. But if... Um, now I'm waiting for someone to snipe me out of midair. But like, once you get your stuff, you kill someone, you don't really have to worry about running over to grab their loot unless you're out of mats. That's the only reason you would want to... Oh, hello. That's the stamp sniper rifle. Oh yeah, I see it over there. Someone's being a little bit crazy. Here, let me see if I can... There, team. Do I want to back out of this situation? I might. Two John Wicks, I don't know how I feel about this. Oh, crap. Oh, got one of you, John Wicks. Oh, but they got me. I have to get out of here. I don't think I can take this fight. Crap. Oh, wait, actually, not crap. See ya! Run away! <laughs> now, I'm assuming they're just going to pursue me, but yeah, I need time to reload this. Oh, okay, John Wick team. Good job. I don't know what he got me with, but still. Oh, he didn't even have the bear yet. That was good, though. I really, I, I, I'll give that to him. He, he knew what he was doing. He knew what he was doing. I'm assuming that was like a purple uh, scoped assault, though. No, I personally will not use the uh, scoped assault in this game mode unless it's my only weapon just because it's very... Uh, like, compared to swapping between the hunting rifles and compared to the Barret, like, it's really just not good for this game. A regular, regular Fortnite, yes, but, like, for Sniper Shootout, no. But anyway, guys, that's gonna conclude today's, I guess, showcasing of the new skin, the Sniper Shootout, and, um, the new Barret. Hope you guys did enjoy. I wish we could got more gameplay with the Barret, but you guys saw how destructively powerful it was. It's pretty, it's pretty good. I like what they did with it, but I guess I'll... See you guys in the next video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you then. Goodbye.